As of the recording and uploading of this video, 151 booster bundles are currently available on Walmart, sold and shipped by Walmart too. So this is not right here, sold and shipped by Walmart.com. This is not third-party resellers. This is $28.98 for booster bundles. Now, if you're not familiar, you, well, why why are you talking about this? Well, currently 151 booster bundles are $52 on the secondary market, right? You guys see this? These are selling at these prices because this is a highly demanded set and there's not enough product out there to meet the demand. So if you are watching this, if you have your notifications enabled, you should be able to pick up the max is 12. However, people have been doing multiple orders. So you can do 12, get another order, do 12. So the reason I bring this up I wasn't going to make a video about this because uh, I was alerted uh, in my Discord, uh, Safeti, uh, huge props, thanks for letting everyone know in the Discord last night. Uh, if you want to join the Discord, the link is in the description, but we were made aware, which is super cool, and I thought usually what happens is, oh, okay, well, you know, the deal's over, it's gone, I, you know, usually you miss it, last an hour, maybe two. People are buying a ton of these, a ton of these. Uh, so also something that's interesting to point out is 10. Uh, there are 10 in a uh, booster display case. And most likely um, they will not ship it in a sealed uh, booster bundle display. But if you order in quantities of 10 or the max of 12, um, there still is a slight chance that that could happen. But... Uh, people were saying that the last time that they had a little restock on these, that that was not the case. But so keep that in mind. But uh, booster bundles currently available, which is kind of big news. Is a this must be a pretty big restock. This must not be the restock that everyone was saying um, was just gonna be uh, you know a few like one booster bundle display per. Uh, Anyways, for the uh, distributor restock, this they, they must have a lot sitting around. So uh, I don't know what that means for the reprint restock th uh, thing. But um, so yeah, I just wanted to share this deal with you guys uh, because it's still available this next morning. So this they, they have a lot. So um, yeah, twenty eight bucks, uh, twenty nine, pretty much call it thirty with tax and everything. Um, when these are going for fifty two. Also, this is also interesting, currently Target has the poster collection available. You get three packs, the promos, which are pretty cool, and a poster for $14.99. Now, I believe the limit here is three. You can only get three from Target, but still not a bad value. And if you need the promos uh, for your master set, it's a great pickup right there. Uh, this on the secondary market. The poster collection going for 27 bucks right so you could get it for 15 here or you can pay 27 on the secondary market point being if you're not familiar the the demand is so high for this product that when you can get it at or below msrp you kind of probably should jump on it if you're interested in one keeping it sealed for your collection or your investment or just ripping the product because yeah you gotta you gotta know uh when you can get this product at, at good prices it's it's been crazy um yeah next up we'll just touch on this we haven't seen the elite trainer boxes get restocked reprinted anything like that and we're like last time i touched on this like they had just cracked 70 and now we're already at 73 dollars is what they're going for on the secondary market which is kind of crazy uh the listed median price is 75 so I don't really expect this to move up too much more, uh, like too quickly, uh, but that can depend. So 151 ETBs still on the uptick, 13% on the three month, 12.39% in one month. So 151 ETBs in high demand, just like every single product. We'll take a look real quick uh, at the ultra premium collection. I have no news about any restocks on this or anything or reprints we don't know currently but 140 139 bucks call it 140 23 percent 
on the last three months and 15.4 just in the last month alone you could have been getting this for 80 90 bucks all day long not that long ago so uh, that is that is interesting now we'll uh we'll take a look at some of the singles real quick this this video is not really super about the singles but there are some that are moving just to touch on i'm just touching on 151's crazy that's just my point here uh currently the Charizard's up almost 8% on three months, only 2% on the one month. Uh, holding strong at that $120 uh, range. But if we look here, uh, last near mint sale was 130 So uh, that is interesting. So we'll see how, how much higher the Charizard can go. The Charmander is insane. This is crazy. Charmander, I don't know if this is has to do with the buyout on TCG or or what, but 56% in the last three months and 16.1% on the one month. Um, yeah, in the $30 range, but yeah, I'm suspecting that this is a buyout of some sort, but 43 43 $43. It's crazy. So um, yeah, that's... It's kind of crazy. Uh, the Blastoise, uh, super beautiful card. Love the artwork. Uh, Arita on the artwork there. Um, so 21% on the three month and almost 10% on the one month. We look at the current sales. Another high sale here, 57.75. So that's, in, we're in the 54, 54, 57. So with the, yeah. That's, uh, I don't know if we're hitting the, if these are just buyouts, people seeing opportunities, or we're hitting the boiling point for 151, but even the Venusaur up 13% on the three month, uh, pretty much flat on the one month. Take a look. So it's at 43 bucks. See if there's any outlying sales. Not really. Uh, yesterday there was a $54 one, which is interesting. So the Venusaur doesn't look like. It's popping off too much, but and then we have the Zapdos uh, cracking, uh, just about cracking 40 bucks here. Pretty flat on the one month, but 4% on the three month. There was a, see, this is what's interesting. $49, $49 sale, two of them back to back. Uh, that was yesterday. So it's interesting. It just seems like there's just such demand for these cards. Uh, the the EX Charizard here, eight percent flat, pretty much on the three month. Outlying sales, not really. Although there was a forty nine ninety nine two days ago, so that that's interesting. Then you got some cards like this, uh, Nine Tails, thirty eight percent on the three month and twenty five percent on the one month. Cards are just jumping up all over the place. Don't, once again, I don't know for sure if this is just uh, buyouts or people needing them for their master sets. Uh, you know, it's we, we don't know at this point. But speaking of all that, I just wanted to I want to double back to the restock reprint thing. I just want to talk about it again. I know it's a, it's a heavily touched on topic. I uh, also wanted to address the. Uh, the Gyarados, right? Uh, my favorite Pokemon, so uh, had to had to wear it just for a video. Um, but the restock reprint. Okay, so we've talked about this a lot on the channel, but I think it's very interesting with uh, Walmart getting apparently a massive restock. And my point being with this is. Because what was announced, well, it wasn't officially announced, but what the distributors were saying was that it was just a restock and that you had to buy some other, um, keep in mind also too, I don't have a dis access to a distributor, so this is third party information from what I'm getting from other people who do have access to distributors, that you could get 151 booster bundle display, but you have to buy a bunch of other stuff that you don't really want as much. It's harder to sell in order to get it. Um, this is pretty common. Distributors do this to move some of the less de like less desired product they'll pair it with a hot selling product um so if that that's the distributor restock you know then uh that's 
that's fine. But what people need to understand is that just because um, that there's a restock doesn't mean that there can't also be a reprint coming. So just just wanted to throw that out there. I'm not saying necessarily that this Walmart uh, is this Walmart massive restock because it does seem pretty big. The fact that it's still live, I, I'm not saying that that indicates uh, a reprint per se. But with where this is at, with the prices that the sealed's at, with the prices that the singles are at, because the singles, a lot of the singles are still going up, which is crazy. Usually, when there's like big restocks or reprints, the single prices are crashing because of the supply and demand but uh 151 is just crazy it's a crazy set the demand is so high i i have a theory that it will be the most master setted set ever um it's just my opinion but i i think it's bringing so many people in and it's so popular you're seeing what's happening so all i'm saying is that it will most likely get another reprint or a reprint and I, I'm not saying that this is it now and it might not even be by this holiday season but if we if we get the reprint after this restock right I wouldn't be surprised at all so it, it only makes sense and I just stand by that it makes too much sense you saw what they did with Japanese 151 the Pokemon company at the end of the day likes to make money their most popular franchise of all time and they like to print money, so they it only makes sense that they would print more 151 because the demand is absolutely insane. Put your thinking caps on and just think about this logically. It it only makes sense. So I think we're 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 gonna hit that at some point. I just we just don't know when. And it could be sooner than we expect, it could be later than we expect. Could be before the holiday season, could be after. Um traditionally we would see it before the holiday season if they're going to follow their patterns that they followed before. So we don't know that for certain, but I just wanted to make this video today to share that hopefully you guys can scoop up some 151 booster bundles. If you're this far in the video and you're not already subscribed, obviously enjoy the content. Um, I do daily Pokemon collecting and investing videos. So if you guys want to uh, subscribe, that would be hugely appreciated by me. Also be beneficial for you. So you guys can stay up to date and not miss deals like this. Also, like I said earlier, if you want to join the Discord uh, so you guys can stay up to date on some of these crazy deals, um, the link is in the description as well. So, uh, yeah, that was super cool to um, be able to scoop up some booster bundles uh, last night. I was pretty thrilled about that. So the Discord came in clutch. Super happy about that. Um, still not a ton of people in there, so um, if you guys want to join, yeah, um, that would be that'd be cool. If not, no worries. Um, but yeah, that, I think that's going to do it for this one, guys. Um, let me know. Let me know in the comments if you were able to pick up some booster bundles. So, um, but yeah, that's going to do it for this one, guys. Booster bundles, uh, poster collections in stock. Um, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. And remember, it was never a